Welcome back to the 313, now brought to you by the all-new 2017 Chrysler Pacifica. Bendel High School girls basketball coach Leanne Steller has to run her practices a bit different than most coaches. Only having eight girls on the court has its challenges, but that number doesn't reflect the team's winning record this season. The Tigers might have a small roster, but they have big dreams of playing at the Breslin in March. Hey, we got goals, things to accomplish. We're not done yet, all right? A couple yep. more days. Together, one, two, three. Together. She tell us to always be hungry and go after what you want in order to rise to the top. And she always just basically tell us to play our ball that, as we do. And we just play our ball as a team. She doesn't want like a big team. She wants us to like stay little because that's kind of unpredictable. Like you don't really see a lot of teams that good with only eight girls. I was a little nervous at first because obviously like a lot of other teams have like a lot more girls than us. But then I knew that like we're all hard workers. So then once the season started going, I was fine with it. Run, keep running on. Good, finish. Let's go, come on. Disadvantage would definitely be game time you know, situations. We can't run through everything. Uh, we do most of it with our JV girls, but so far, you know, they've handled that transition of mostly do things in fours. I feel like it's a good thing because when you run the four back and forth, it kind of helps your conditioning with you in practice as in the game. We run every day, and we'll run for four, just 45 minutes straight, just running. And that's what we do on the court is just run. So, I mean, that really beats up teens is when we just keep running back and forth and they can't keep up. I play my entire bench. Everybody gets to play. Everybody gets to be a part of the action. Every person has a job and is, is very important into what our whole main goal is here. Together! They never look at another team's size or, or you know, look at stats or, you know, even look at numbers. They probably think that, oh, they only have eight, like, this is going to be easy, like, we can just run them out and everything, but then they never do. I mean, we're eight strong. It's, we don't have one really good player or one really bad player. We're all really connected. Our chemistry is, like, it, it bonds stronger each year. I feel like this year was more of a, a loving, caring chemistry with our team, and it kind of brought us closer and to play together more and love each other. Well, I don't, I, don't, I kind of don't think it's like any other team I've been on because we're all just like so close. I think it's really our dedication to the team and knowing our part is really big too. We know we have eight girls. We know we all have to stay healthy and we all have to work hard for each other, not just for the wins. We have to do it for each other. So our main goal is to get the bridge competition is only going to get harder so we're going to have to pick up our part because every other team is going to be picking up their part as well. We use the banners as a motivation too because last time was 1991 so we want to we get numbers back on there. I want 2017 to be a group that started this new turnover, this new tradition and I want these girls because of what they've done to be the ones that started this. <laughs> 